Hi, I'm Dr. Dave Ahern of Design Ergonomics. For over two decades, my company's been designing the most efficient sterilization, resupply, and restocking areas in our dental office plans. It's an area that doctors immediately understand once they're using their new office. And while the flow of our plans for these areas has been ideally optimized, we've sometimes been frustrated with the sterilization area build quality from a contractor or big box store construction. Contractors just haven't built out these areas with the attention to detail and durability that they require. And the other supposed choice, the typical Sterocenter, you know with the colored lights. Well, in my opinion, they're just a huge waste of money because they do little to improve the flow or increase storage. So for years, we've thought that sterilization areas should be so much more than they are and that it'd be great service to our clients to make sure that the detail of all the big and little things that make the area perform at its peak and then to specify how to make the area durable, efficient, and cost effective. It wasn't my plan to build a sterilization product. It was just an obsession with getting things perfectly optimized for the team in my own practices so that they could get even more efficient and provide great dental care. We frequently give tours to visiting dentists and partners and clients. One day after years of optimizing this, working again and again and again to try and make this better and better, a doctor who was touring the practice looked at one of my team members and said, this is exactly the sterilization area that I want. I want this. So we designed it for him. And after designing it for a few doctors who insisted upon them, we decided to offer this to all of our clients. It's called the Desergo Sterilization Center. Creative, huh? So here's how Desergo works. First, all traffic is linear, right to left or left to right. You can plan it in either direction. There's none of the crossing back and forth that's so common in a typical sterilization area. When you land your contaminated tray, you may want a smaller trash drop at the start. This is generally for offices that don't have sufficient trash capacity at chairside. You don't see this option here because the volume of trash available on the EP treatment workstations makes this unnecessary. The next element is ridiculously simple, soak. Soak is just that, keeping instruments moist. Think about the design of a typical Sterocenter again. Those things with the colored lights. What they do is to take the instruments waiting to be processed and then dry them out in this hot little cabinet with the red lights. I don't know. We can't remember if these instruments are clean or dirty, really. So as a result, beyond not starting with the disinfection process immediately, you're baking on the buyer burden, which then you're supposed to blast off with ultrasonics. This makes no sense. We'll come back to ultrasonics in a moment. We have a different start process, which is to immediately immerse your instruments in an enzymatic cleaning solution designed to dissolve buyer burden, cheap and reliable and quiet. And then once you're ready to process this batch, you've softened any biological material that remains from treatment. You could certainly use an ultrasonic, but they're small, noisy, and inevitably become a toxic and contaminated soup that makes rinsing difficult or even unsafe. If you want more information about this process, there are some links in the video description that will be helpful. But let's talk about the soak area a little bit more before we move on. First, You'll notice a three-chambered sink. Smaller offices can often get by with a two-chambered sink. However, larger offices and offices processing orthodontic pliers and surgical forceps will want to have an area for milk bath, so it's great to have a third chamber. Note the removable splash shield. This is especially helpful for those offices that must scrub instruments. So what do we do exclusively to prepare our instruments for autoclaving? That's simple, a washer. I've done this for over 30 years long before there were dedicated washers available. When done properly, it's a fantastic, fast, and safe process. At this point, you need to be able to quickly and easily bag or wrap your instruments for autoclaving. We've designed our Desergo Sterilization Center to have instrument staging space separate from the primary work surface. When you see pictures of a typical Sterocenter, you always see them when they're not at work. When we benchmark these offices years ago, we constantly find them extremely short of counter workspace. You'll also note here a very large trash volume. No one has time to be taking trash out in the middle of a busy day, so why not the makers of these Sterocenters make room for it? We suggest a tow pole access instead of a trash hole in the counter. We don't want anything to fall in that hole, and you can use every bit of counter space that you can get. 
While finishing up the processing side of sterilization, let me point out a few other features. Note the assortment of adjustable slat wall accessories. And above is our specially designed version of our pull-down cabinets in triple format. This is twice the storage volume of a typical top cabinet and triple that which is actually reachable by shorter people without a step stool. Who has the time to go get that? Next, let's discuss autoclaves. Our rack system was created after looking at hundreds of delaminated sterilization cabinets. We decided that for multiple reasons, we'd create a fully modular rack system. First, it's chrome steel and aluminum, designed to restaurant specifications. Restaurants deal with the challenges of heat, steam, salt, and lots of heavy traffic. The kind of traffic that a successful office is going to get. Second, it's mobile. Have you ever tried to pull a full, broken autoclave out of the narrow sterilization slot to unplug it? It's not pretty. Here, you simply remove the top vent panel and slide the entire chassis out. Most often, this permits repair without removal. It also makes cleaning the area much simpler. Note the custom design vent fan assembly. Removable side panels channel exhaust flow up and out of the rack and the room. No more boiling hot sterilization area. By the way, this rack unit can be purchased separately to help fix problems that you realize you have right now. If you aren't ready for a complete changeover, this might be something you want to consider. Now let's move on to the clean side of the process. You need a source of extremely clean water and you need easy access to the filters. Does your Star Center do this? Above this we find our specially designed cassette storage pull down. This is designed to handle extreme weight when fully loaded with cassettes. Without it you'd have to add at least five extra feet of length to this room or lose another vital storage area as for example this very useful small instrument and specialty drawer unit which you want to have in low cabinets for easier visual access to smaller and less commonly used items. The Desergo Stero Center was developed through our continuing obsession with providing great dental care. It's been tested and enhanced over and over for years in my own practice and now in other select practices. Quite honestly, I owe you an apology. We should have made this available to you long ago.